Hello, in this video I want to talk about the Android runtime, Dalvik and APK files. So let's start with the Android runtime. So if you are familiar with Java, you will be familiar with the bytecode concept and the class file concept. So what happens is when you compile a Java file, then it's compiled to bytecode, which is nothing but a class file. And then you have the JVM, a Java virtual machine, which works on this class file, right? Now, when it comes to Android, things change a little. So what happens is, uh, after you have this class file, I mean the bytecode, then it's again converted to a .dex file, okay? And let me tell you about this DEX format. So this is the Dalvik executable format, okay? And what happens is this is the format on which a Dalvik, uh, a Dalvik processor works, which is nothing but a virtual processor uh, like the JVM. So JVM and Dalvik both are like virtual processors, just theoretical. And uh, uh, so, so like I was saying, the class file is converted to a .dex file on which Dalvik works. So that's the that's the picture of you know the JVM versus the Dalvik thing. And then what happens is after you have this file, then it's all compressed along with resource and um, and you know data files to be converted to an APK file, which is application package and which can be deployed to your Android device. Um, like the final thing which gets deployed to your Android device or to the Google Play Store. So this is the whole story of how the process works. So you have a Java file, it's converted to a class file, then converted to a DEX format and then this DEX format is packaged with other files to be, con to be packaged as an APK file which is in turn uploaded <coughs> to the Google Play Store. So you can find more documentation in Android, of course. So you can learn more about ART and Dalvik, which is, uh, they have explained it pretty well. And then you have these different formats, which is like bytecode format, DEX format, and the whole packaging thing, how it works and stuff. So I hope this clarifies um, how the Android runtime works for you. And maybe in subsequent video, I'll try to explain uh, things beyond this. Okay. Okay. Take care.